This video is on salting and key stretching. Let's talk about hashing first. Hashing is used to convert input into another value. It's usually used to convert password into something else before they store it into the database. Every time user logs in and puts in the password, it gets converted into a hash value and gets that hash value compared to the one in the database for authentication. And this is done to protect against attackers. If attackers compromise the database with your password, with hash, they don't have the password itself. However, hashing algorithm can be broken. This is where salting comes in. Salting is where you add string of characters to user's password before hashing. Salt prevents attackers from dictionary lookup to see how popular passwords get hashed and prevents attackers from guessing the hash function and unlocking entire database of passwords. To even make it more difficult for attackers, you can use key stretching. The goal here is to stretch the password so that deciphering the password becomes more costly due to required memory, time, and money. It basically iterates the hash of the salted password. Hash functions are basically looped, simulating randomness and adding more bits to the complexity of the password before it goes into the database. Here it's looped 10,000 times, for example. The goal of a password stretching software is to increase computational time on the attacker system.